Nearly 20 million children across the country under five years of age are now eligible to be vaccinated against COVID-19. The CDC endorsed an advisory panel's unanimous recommendation today. John Fanolio from our Los Angeles sister station has details. They were the last group unable to be vaccinated until now. We now know based on rigorous scientific review that the vaccines available here in the United States can be used safely and effectively in children under five. The CDC on Saturday signing off on emergency authorization of COVID-19 vaccines for infants, toddlers and preschoolers. The Food and Drug Administration gave the green light last week. Vaccinating young children is a critical opportunity to protect them against hospitalization and death from COVID-19. The new rules allow for significantly lower doses of the Pfizer and Moderna vaccine to be administered. The Pfizer shot can be given to children six months to four years old. It's a three dose regimen with the first two doses spaced three weeks apart. The third dose given at least eight weeks later. The Moderna vaccine is available to children between six months and five years old with two doses spaced four weeks apart. I think it's great. I think, you know, it doesn't seem like COVID is slowing down. And I think, um, you know, we need to protect not only our children, but, you know, their older family members. And um, I have confidence. I think the benefits outweigh the risks at this point with the information that we do have. But of course, many other parents have serious reservations. What do you say to parents out there who are skeptical, who believe there there's not enough data out there to support giving this vaccine to such young children? to be some valid uh, questioning uh, that goes into it. However, by now we've had even more studies and more research and more knowledge about these vaccines. And they've done an amazing number of very strenuous uh, studies on these to, to try and make sure as best they can, the FDA and the CDC obviously, to understand and weigh the risk and benefits of, of, of this vaccine. In the big picture of things, uh, I think uh, there's been a lot of studies done that will now show and prove to them uh, that uh, this will be safe for their kids. And uh, what you can do is talk to your pediatricians. That was John Finolio reporting. Shots are expected to be available early next week. Millions of doses were already ordered for hospitals and clinics around the country.